So guys, for the first step, you want to head over to search and then type in Windows Defender Firewall. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to click on Advanced Settings. And then you want to click on Inbound Rules. And then click on New Rule. And then you want to click on Port. And then click on Next. And then you want to select UDP. And then in this box right here, you want to type in 49152-65535. Click on Next. Click on Next again. Click on Next again. And then you could just put any name you want. So I'll just put Call of Duty and then click on Finish. Now for the second step, we're going to head over to Search and then type in CMD. Then you want to run it as administrator. And then click on Yes. Now once you're on this, we're going to type in ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS and click on Enter. Then we're going to type in netsh space winsock space reset and click on Enter again. It's going to ask you to restart your computer, but don't restart it yet until you complete the next steps in the video. Now for the next step, you want to head over to search and then type in allow an app through Windows Firewall. Now once you're on this, you want to click on change settings and then click on allow another app and then click on browse. You want to find where you have Call of Duty installed. So for me personally, it's on this PC, C drive, program files 86, Steam, scroll down again, Steam apps, common, Call of Duty HQ, MP23, and then you want to find the Call of Duty.exe file. You want to double click on it, which will then make it appear here. And then click on Add. And then it will appear here. And click on OK. Now for the next step, we're going to head over to Search and then type in View Network Connections. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to find your network adapter. You want to double click on it. And then click on Properties. And then click on Internet Protocol version 4. You want to make sure that use the following DNS server just has been ticked. You want to make the first line 8888. And you want to make the second line 8844. And then click on OK. Now once you complete all the steps in the video, you want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.